We're now here in the green and yellow bean field at McGregor's Produce. Yep. Uh, this is the first time that I've ever seen bean plants. Yeah, well we have uh, quite a few acres of uh, yellow beans it's something we and green beans. Mm -hmm. It's something we start uh, early in the season, one of the first things we plant. You can see there's a bit of plastic here on the ground that we plant into. And uh, the ground is quite cold in April when we start planting these things mm -hmm. uh, into the ground. So the, the clear plastic allows the, uh, the seeds to, uh, to germinate quicker because it warms up the soil. And then that allows us to have our bean crop uh, earlier in the season. So we, right. we have them ready now. Okay. And now you mentioned that you were picking uh, the field yesterday. So how do you ensure that you have enough beans to sustain you throughout the summer? Well, we, we, we plant about once a week mm -hmm. uh, throughout the summer. Uh, we start in early April. I think it was about the 10th of April this year, and then just keep going once that starts. I just planted some this morning, actually, mm -hmm. and uh, we'll continue on until about the 1st of August, so it allows us to have a, a continuous flow of fresh uh, beans at our, at our stands mm -hmm. and at our markets all through the summer and into, uh, into the fall. And most times we try and get to Thanksgiving weekend, and, and some years we have. So. Yeah, weather permitting, Yeah, I weather permitting, that's right. What's the um, lifespan of a bean from the time that it is planted to when it's ready to be picked like this? It, it's about 60 days. Okay. So it takes, yeah, 60 days to to uh, plant the seed, and, and then it germinates mm -hmm. and grows up into the to a nice big lush green plant like this. You can see the little flowers right here mm -hmm. that, uh, that they start producing early, and then it goes on and starts to produce these little beans and then as it keeps growing them, they just keep beans. getting bigger and then these are ones here are ready to harvest so all you do is just pull them off like that gently mm -hmm. and then we pick into uh, into bushels and then we sell them at our markets and stands perfect like and, and if you head to the website or uh, call the berry line you can find out uh, all of the different locations because you said you have 12 satellite stands that's right yep. and five different farmers markets that's right there's five different farmers markets most of them are on saturday mm -hmm. uh, there is one on sunday at the auto farmers market uh, okay. across from croton university that we go to so we were picking raspberries earlier in the morning because yes. they're now now ready you can yes. either pick your own or buy them you've got green and yellow beans what what other produce do you offer we also offer uh, strawberries when when they're they're available unfortunately the strawberry season is now over for us um, we, we do have some day neutral strawberries which will be later on in the season which is just we sell at our stands as well what's a day neutral mean it means that uh, they're not affected by day length so we have our regular strawberry season during the long days in june because mm -hmm. they are affected by day length or day neutrals are not, so oh. they go later on. Okay. And then we also offer, uh, we have tomatoes, uh, which start in early August. And our other big crop for us is sweet corn, which yes. I think we're going to go check out in a minute. Right, okay, so we're going to head over to the sweet corn field next. That is what we would come to uh, McGregor's for every single, pretty much, yeah. every day or every it, few days when we were at the cottage. Yeah, it's been one crop we've, we've been growing since the start. My dad started with, uh, I think it was an acre of sweet corn back 30-some years ago, and it's just grown from there. So. What are you at now? Uh, this year we're growing 60 acres, so right. it's, it's grown quite a bit. That's great. Okay, so uh, again, you can head to the website to look at all of the different uh, locations in which you can find McGregor's Produce, or my favorite was always just to come here to the farm. What That's are the right. hours that you're open yep. that people can come uh, by? Monday to, f Monday to Thursday, we're open 8 a.m. to 8 p.m., mm -hmm. and Friday, Saturday, Sunday, we're open 8 to 5. Great. All right, uh, I guess I should get back to picking, eh? I have sure, that, yeah. that <laughs> problem of eating more than I pick. <laughs> well, there's nothing better than fresh beans. <laughs>